Hello there, I am Giant Girl with more Pokemon Leaf Green we do. In the last part, we took on Nugget Bridge, and before that, we took on Matt for our third rival battle. I showed off in the Nugget Glitch, and off screen, I did get 255 Nuggets, as I'll show you guys right here, actually. Yeah, 255 Nuggets. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna be selling like 100 of these to get max money, so let's do that right now, actually. Just so we don't forget. <laughs> let's go to the Mart. Nice, and uh, right now I have zero poker dollars because I spent all my money before getting all the nuggets, so we can go from zero to the max amount of money right now. Right here, right now. Let's go to sell nuggets. We're going to sell 99 of them. There we go. Um, and then another 99. And so those, we, we spent, we sold uh, 198 nuggets now, and all I have to do is sell two more. And we'll have max money. That's pretty cool, yeah. Now we have max money, that's awesome. So let's go to the bike shop real quick, just for laughs, because I want to show something here. Which you probably already know what it is, if you played first generation, or, or even this game, third generation of Pokemon. Let's talk to the device, not the device giver, but let's talk to the bike shop guy. Cashier, okay, um, yeah, for, hold on, I your dialogue, sorry. Hi, welcome to the bike, to our bike shop. Um, have we just got the bike for you? Yeah, the bicycle is a million poker dollars, but in this game, I think it changed in X and Y, and then to present. You can have a million poker dollars in those games, but back in third generation, you could have 999,999 poker dollars. So one poker dollar short, and we can't even get, oh wait, we have to get, we have to get the bike voucher actuator, which is how we get the bicycle in this game. But I want to show you that, like, even though I have max money, I still can't buy a bicycle for a million dollars. Because that's like a little joke they put in there. Anyway, let's, um, buy some stuff. Let's see, Pokeballs, let's buy four, I guess. Super potions, let's buy, let's buy ten. Yeah, ten's good. Potions, let's buy five, I guess. Antidotes, let's see, let's buy one more antidote. Paralysis heals, let's buy two more paralysis heals. One, uh, let's buy two more awakenings, I guess. Uh, burn heal, I don't, well, let's have, let's have one, let's have two burn heals just to be safe. Because you never know, you could get burned by ember, you know, in this game. Okay, so yeah. Let's you okay, skip ups I don't need and repels. Okay, let's buy Hmm, let's buy twenty. There we go, nice. Let's organize our bag real quick. Burn heels, yeah. Let's put that like right here. And we have thirty three repels, still have fifty five nuggets. We got fifteen potions and fifteen super potions, that's awesome. So we're good for now, yeah. Now, I have my actual team with me. I put um, Moneymaker back in the PC because I don't really want her in my party anymore. Because uh, she did what she had to do with the Nugget glitch, but I don't really like carrying her around. She just does splash and everything. So I have Triple Clef, Giant Green, and Airbender, and of course Mushroom, my HM Slave that will learn Cut and Flash eventually. So, let's go take on the Team Rocket Grunt and actually win this time. Let's win on purpose instead of lose again on purpose with a with a money maker. We're gonna win on purpose. We're gonna try to win actually, I should say. So yeah, oh wait, hold on, I wanna talk to you. What do you have to say? The people here were robbed. That's so oh my goodness, I feel so bad. And and you you know their house stays look you know, their house stays the same where it looks like it's robbed the whole game, which is very sad. I feel bad for them. Okay, it's obvious that Team Rocket is behind the, this most heinous crime. Even our police force has trouble with the rockets. Yeah, they need to be stopped. They're just the, they're the antagonists in this game, I guess you could say. And you're in the player is the protagonist. Whether you started as a whether you, you um chose the boy or girl character in this game. So let's take on this rocket grunt. Congratulations, you beat the five contest trainers. You earned a fabulous prize. We get another nugget. Awesome, so now I fifty six nuggets, that's awesome. By the way, how would you like to join Team Rocket? Nah, we're a good professional criminal specializing in Pokemon. That's wrong. N want to join? No. Are you sure? Nah, I'm good. Come on, I'm telling you to join. No way. Join us. No way. I'm telling you to join. Never. Okay, and you're convincing. Okay, fine. I'll make an offer you can't refuse, which is a battle. Yeah. We can't refuse a battle, I guess. <laughs> Especially if it's from a trainer. <coughs> Even if it's um, a Team Rocket grunt. Jeez. Kinda coughed and choked there for a little bit. 
HP is still down as Ekans, level 15. You know, it's intimidate, so it's gonna cut our attack. It's gonna lower our defense stat by one, or triple cuffs the defense stat. Make a punch attack. I'm hoping this does at least half, but we'll see. Yeah, it does half. Cool. Let's just make a punch again. It's gonna lower our defenses again. One stat. Again, Colfair is a triple cuffs defense. We took down the Ekans, that's good. And a Zubat, okay. Um, I'm I'm gonna go for a Mega Kick and hopefully it'll hit. But you never know, it could miss. That's it. That, that, there's a big chance that I might miss. I think it only has like 70, 70 accuracy. Which I actually check at the beginning. Of this, I'll check at the end of this battle. I'm the beginning of this battle. Wow, get shot me out. It worked and Mega Kick hit. Nice. Let's go. Let's finish it with a Mega Punch. We'll be mobilized by love. It'll attack Kofari. It's mobilized by love. Cool, then it doesn't attack, dang it. Dang it, make a punch miss. Okay, let's trip pound then. It will not attack again, or will it be... Okay, it'll attack then. It wasn't immobilized, it wasn't immobilized by love that time. So, yeah, pound attack. There we go, nice. There goes a Zubat. And with that, triple cuff crew level 17, awesome. I was trying to use... Oh no, I don't, I don't want to... I don't want triple cuff to follow me. Jeez. Become the center of attention, but it's not really of use to me, you know. I don't want to learn. I don't want to make sure of a couple learn that. Jeez, thanks for the four dollars and eighty cents, man. With your ability, you'd become a top leader in Team Rocket. Come on, think of the opportunity. Don't let this chance go to waste. Never. I will never join Team Rocket. Okay, so let's check um, Mega a Kicks. Uh, dang it. Let's check Mega a Kicks um, accuracy on Colferry. Let's see here, um, it's 75%, but it has 120 power, but it's like, accuracy is 75, Mega Punch, its power is 80, but its accuracy is 85, so it's slightly more accuracy for Mega Punch, but it's like a little bit weaker than Mega Kick. Okay, so let's take on this trainer right here, it's the Camper, nice. If you, I saw your feet, I saw your feet from the grass. Um, I don't know if this is a typo, but shouldn't it be F-E-E-T, not F-E-A-T? I don't know, it looks like a typo to me, but I could be wrong, you know, I could be wrong. Here's Camper Shane, send out Rata. Okay, level 14. Send out Shiva Clef. Make a punch this thing. Okay, it has Hyper Fang, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, oh, critical, jeez. Ah, oh, man. Okay, there goes the Rata, at least. I'm gonna stay in. Hopefully, I'm gonna heal though, cause Trebuchet's getting low on HP. And the attack, uh, intimidate hits. Uh, oh, its ability to intimidate cuts its attack, so that's not good. Okay, let's use a super potion on this thing. On Trebuchet, actually, not this thing. Jeez, okay. Poison sting. Ooh. No poison. Not poison Trebuchet. That's just the worst. He's gonna wrap on us now. Yeah, we're gonna make a punch hit again. Awesome. Uh, wrap and poison. Yeah, hyper wrap and the by poison. It's not good. Good thing it didn't flinch. Oh man, make a kick and miss. I mean, make a punch and miss. No. That's a bad time to miss. There we go, make a punch hit that time. So that's good. Pretty if he can't for Shane. I thought it was I thought not. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the tails, 80 cents. So I'm gonna use another I'm gonna use an antidote and a super another super potion on Trouble Clef. Okay. And then let's use an antidote. Nice, okay. I don't think there's an item down here, but let's check real quick. Why not? Um, nope, there isn't. Okay. I might run into a Pokemon. Oh, I didn't. Awesome. Nice. Up here is the TM for, um, Attract TM45. So, I won't be teaching it the, um, Turbo Cuff, though. I was originally thinking about it for one of its final movesets, but, um, I am not gonna teach, uh, Attract, um, Turbo Cuff, actually, so. Yeah, or to name my other Pokemon. Let's go switch to Giant Green. Because this is a hiker, dude. 
Here he is, okay. I just got down from Mount Moon, but I still got gas in the tank. Okay. Did you drive through Mount Moon? I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, here's a hiker. He hiked through Mount Moon. Of course, he's a hiker. Okay, so there he said I'm gonna level 15. Okay. So let's use Vine Whip on this thing. Just focus energy, okay. At level 22, uh, I have a Solar Wounds Razor Leaf, which is nice. So I'm looking forward to that. Because Razor Leaf, I think, has 25 PP and it's power more, it's, it's power, it's more, has more power than Vine Whip. Okay, Jude, I'm gonna definitely stay in. There we go, nice. A hit, one hit KO, awesome. Go, giant green, go level 21, yay. Hiker defeated Franklin, or, uh, no, uh, we defeated Franklin the hiker, jeez. You worked hard. Thanks for the $5.40, man. Really appreciate it. Now in this discussion, I can catch an Abra, and I'm actually going to be catching an Abra off screen because I want to get a um, Mr. Mime for my playthrough and get one of my final members of my team. And uh, you need to trade this guy um, uh, right outside Diglett Cave on the um, on the um, other side of Diglett Cave. Um, there's this little house near like um, where um, the entrance to like the Ridden Forest is. It's, or, um, like Route 3 where there's tra the little transitional route between Viridian Forest and Peter City. There's a little house and that guy will trade you a um, Mr. Mime for a Abra. So yeah. And I'm going to use an, uh, Mr. Mime on my team. On my team. Makes a good Pokemon. And that's the only way you can get Mr. Mime in this game. So I have to do it. I have to do the trade I guess. If I want Mr. Mime of course. Local trainers come here to practice. Yeah it's a good training spot honestly. Doesn't end up being the best training spot by the end of the game, but still a good training spot, I guess. For, for, for Pokemon you want to uh, like level 14 to 17 that you need, well, to level up worth, I guess, is, you know, will suffice for this area. <laughs> okay, so yeah, it's Survivor Divine Whip. Okay, it's gonna use Tail Whip on us or on Giant Green, or his defense stat by one. Cool. But there goes the Rattle. Because the joy's about these Sparrow. Okay, I'm actually gonna stay in. Even though Sparrow knows Peck. The Sparrow probably knows, knows Peck, but let's just see if we can take it out though. Fast. Ooh, a critical hit. Awesome. That's what I wanted. I'm taking it out fast. Awesome. Okay. Wait a few youngster Joey. You're decent. Thanks. Okay, thanks for 2004 cents, man. Really appreciate it. I picked up a berry, um, back there. I forgot what it was though. I'll put it on screen right now because I forget. You're going to see Bill. First we battle. Okay. We'll battle. Here's another hiker. This is hiker Wayne. He has an onyx. Cool. Level 17. Jeez, vine up on this thing. There we go. Nice. One hit KO. So close to level 22. <laughs> Okay, um, you're something, thanks. Thanks for six dollars, twelve cents, man. And you want to spend some money after you get your max money from those nuggets, if you're gonna get max money like I did. I meant to go to my trainer card. Um, so like, yeah, it's it's gonna climb back up when, with all these, um, wins from these trainers and stuff eventually, so keep that in mind. Cause like, if you get m m prize money from being a trainer, but you already have max money, it's not gonna raise it, cause it's max... It's maxed out on money, the money amount, so make sure you spend some of your money too if you're doing the same way. Same thing I'm doing with just like getting max money by getting all those nuggets through the nugget glitch. Anyway, Dad took me to a great party on the SSN at Vermillion City. Ooh, that's where we're headed soon, yay! That's actually where we get cut at the end of that. We get the cut from the um, captain, so that's pretty cool. So that's a poke level 17, okay. Let's use Vine Whip on this thing. Oh man, it survived, okay. So he's gonna use Confusion, that's gonna be super effective. Because it's a Psychic type move, and Giant Green is half, um, Poison, so... And Poison's, uh, weak to, um, Psychic type moves. Yeah. Level 22, yay. Giant Green is trying to win Razor Leaf, but, yeah, Giant Green can't win more than four moves. Do we move to, delete a move to make room for Razor Leaf? Yes. Okay, so let's get rid of, um... Let's get rid of um, Leech Seed, honestly. Yeah. 
Giant Green, forgot Leech Seed, and Giant Green Lion Razor Leaf. Okay. Nice. I'm not mad. Okay. Thanks for the 2072 cents. Okay, I'm gonna switch over to back to Triple Cuff, I guess. Let's switch these two. Okay, let's take on this picnicker. Nice, okay. Hey, my boyfriend is so is cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. You're doing mail, okay. Choose a mega punch on this thing. It's gonna lose a leer it's gonna use a leer because it's a little bit faster than Triple Cuff. But yeah, the Mega Punch hits. And let's use Mega Punch again. I'm gonna use it again to lower Triple Cuff's defense stat. Another, another by one again. So yeah, there we go. Nice. Neither and female. Get sure she has neither and male and neither and female. Good for your Pokedex while they're playing Leaf Green or Fire Red. Because neither and female is um, more common in um, Leaf Green, and then neither and male is more common in Pokemon Fire Red or Fire Red for that matter. See so his tail whip. That's cool. I'm not worried. We got this. There we go, yeah. Triple Cuff gained some experience, and now it's level 18. I defeat Picnicker Kelsey. My conditioning isn't the best. Well, you can work on it, it's okay. Thanks for the $3, Picnicker. <laughs> okay, so. Right here. I'm gonna switch back to Giant Green, because this is a hiker dude. He made stuff with a Machop, but I'm not exactly sure. I'm off to see a Pokemaniacs collection at the Cape. Cool. Gonna send out Gia, dude. Okay. Gia's vinyl bonus thing. Cause it'll faint it. There we go. Cause four times it's four times weak to grass type moves. So that's nice. I have the advantage. Another Gia, dude. Okay. Let's use vinyl again. Nice. Geodude again. Three Geodudes in a row. Maybe he has three Geodudes in Onyx or something. Vinyl again. I have one more vinyl after this, but I still have um, Razor Leaf, which has like 25 PP, which is awesome. Well, I'm a chop. Okay, let's switch actually to um, Airbender. Airbender hasn't got to fight in this part at all, really. Like, at all. <laughs> cool. My chop. Let's go for the gust attack. Yeah, it's level 13, but it goes down. You done, you done got me, and real good, too. Thanks for the $4.68, man. Really appreciate it. Okay, so let's switch to uh, Airbender, I guess. Well, we can switch to Triple Cough, actually. Triple Cough is two levels below Airbender. The difference between all three of my Pokemon right now are um, through two levels, because I think Triple Cough is level 18, Airbender is level 20, and then uh, Giant Green is level 22. I'm a cool guy, I've got a girlfriend. Good for you. Let's see what you can do in battle. Let's see what Pokemon you have. Kemper Flint, sent out Rata. Okay. Go for the Mega Punch here. It's gonna outspeed us, okay. It's gonna outspeed Colfairy. Cute charm, yay. My phones are dinging. <laughs> no. I might just I might just use pound because Mega Punch isn't really I'm not having good luck with Mega Punch hitting, even though it's eighty five percent accuracy, but that's okay. It's still draw pound. Yeah, it's pounded again. It's in love with triple cuff again. I think it was mobile but over the last turn, I could be wrong. That time it wasn't, I'm pretty sure. Or it clearly wasn't that time, honestly, because he used tail whip. There we go, nice. Atkins, okay, I'll stay in. Let's use, yeah, let's use poison sting and poison triple cliff. Man. Coffee is now hurt by the rap too. 
it will be. Hurt by poison and hurt by the wrap. Oh man. One, one, one more pound should do it though. Yeah, there we go, nice. And it fainted it, nice. Where to go, Trouble Cough? You held on. Oh darn. Thanks for 280 cents. Right here is the TM for a uh, secret power. I won't be teaching them my Pokemon, but it's a very good move actually. Depends on like, the area you're in. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. Switch over to Airbender. I'm gonna use the Antidote on Trouble Cleft so she doesn't die of, or faint because of poison. You know. But she's probably gonna be sitting out for a while, you know. I think there's like one more trainer. Oh, there's two more actually on this little route. So here's a youngster. I had, a I had this feeling I knew I had to battle you. Are you psychic or something? Jeez. Okay. Cool. Youngster Chad would like the battle. Set to Ekans, okay. Level 14. It's gonna have Intimidate probably, so it's gonna cut a ranger's attack. Yeah. She's Gus then. Snakes are kind of pretty intimidating in my life too anyway, so I don't I get why. As intimidated as this ability. Critical hit. Dang it. Let's go for another Gus. This should faint it. Nice. What else do you have on your team? A Sand Shrew, okay. Let's actually stay in. I don't know how much a gust will do, so I'll have to test it. Sentry's level 14 male. Pretty cool. She's another gust. Okay. I'm gonna use quick attack this time. For the next turn. There we go. One more quick attack should do it. Send the attack key and I prevents accuracy loss, which is awesome for us. And there we go, nice. Fighting for youngster Chad, yay. I knew I'd lose too. Aw, sorry guys, sorry man. Thanks for the 2024 cents though. And here finally we will last. Oh here's a berry actually, because it's a dark spot. A block berry, cool. Put in the berry pouch, nice. Let's take on this last. My friend has many cute Pokemon, I'm so jealous. Okay. Let's go send an Oddish, okay, level 13 female. Let's use Gust on this thing because it'll be super effective. Because, you know, flying super effective against grass. So, that's good. There we go. Airbender is in level 21. Okay, what about these Pidgey? Okay, we'll stay in. Pidgey is level 13 and it's female. So, hopefully, two Gusts will take it out. We'll move a Gust and a Quick Attack, actually. Quick Attack, yay. There we go, nice. And finally, she has another Oddish, okay. So let's use Gust on this Oddish again because it's super effective then. There we go. Nice. Put it to feed the last Haley, cool. I'm not so jealous. Thanks for the 2008 cents. Okay, here is Bill's house right here. Uh, sea Cottage. Bill lives here. Okay, cool. There we go. Oh man, what's this Clefairy doing here? Hey, I'm a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemaniac. Hey, what's with the skeptical look? I'm not joshing you, pal. Uh, I screwed up an experiment and got you combined with a Pokemon. So how about it? Help me out here? Yes. If you say no, you have to come and exit his house and come back in. I tried, like, saying yes, but then leaving. Or saying no and then leaving, and then I had to come back in and talk to him again. So I'll just help him out. Wait till I get inside the teleporter. Then when I do, then when I do, go to my PC and run the cell separation system. So yeah, I could leave him actually right now by saying even yes. But I want to just help him out. I'm true to my word. Steven uh, in initiated the teleporter's cell separator. Nice. Ooh, it's blinking light. Awesome. And then should come out the left one too. Ta-da! It's Bill! Yay, it even has a little chime, too. So let's talk to him again. Yeah! Thanks, bud! I owe you one! So, did you come here to see my Pokemon collection? Yes, I did! You didn't? Oh man, I'm, I I wanted to see your Pokemon and the the Eeveelutions and everything. The Eevee? I wanted to see Eevee, Ferion, Vaporeon, and uh, Jolteon. Man, it's putting noise in my mouth. 
That's a bummer. I got to thank you. Oh, here. Maybe this will do. Received the SS ticket from Bill. Cool. Okay, we put the key on his pocket. That cruise ship, uh, the, the cruise ship SS, SS Anne is in Des Moines City. I hear there's a lot of trainers on board, too. They invited me to get to the party, but I can't stand fancy news. Why don't you go instead of me? Go on and have a good time. Thanks. I think you have to exit his house and then go back in just to see his pages of, like, the evolutions, like I was saying before. So let's go to his PC, actually. Bill's favorite Pokemon list. Uh, which Pokemon do you want to see? Eevee. Um, of course I want to see Flareon too, and Jolteon, and finally Vaporeon, and quit looking. Dang, I, I, I looked at Eevee twice, I guess, because Eevee's pretty cool. <laughs> Deserves a second look. And if you look at it, then your end of the Pokedex, it adds a lot of pages to your Pokedex. If I just scroll down. You see, okay, Eevee, Vaporeon, Jolteon, and Flareon. So that's pretty cool. Just like um, Matt did, you know? He went to Bill's house to see his rare Pokemon list, and that's why I just did the Nice. Okay. Um, this cape is, fam is a famous date spot. Misty, the gym leader, has high hopes for about this place. Okay. Uh, hello, are you here alone? If you're out in at Suleen's cape, well, it should be as a couple. Okay, interesting. It doesn't have to be, though. So, yeah. And the next part will take on the Suwain City Gym, actually, finally. Now that I finish everything up north of Suwain City. Okay, Team Rocket Grunts, so we have to deal with them in the next part, I guess. The next part will just be the gym, really. I'm thinking, like, the sep one part, the whole part, we should just do the gym, actually, or something, you know? Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Um, we put Trobocop to the front. Yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna heal off screen, of course. So this has been the end of my Pokemon Leaf Green Walk the Guy. We do walk the guy part, and the next part we'll take on the Suwon City Gym. It's a water type gym, so that's pretty cool. So yeah, so this has been Dranko again. I would like to thank you for watching again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys next part of my Pokemon Leaf Green Redo Walkthrough Guide.